got the FCS spin guide. Uh, uh, Keone's here and he's going to give us a rundown on how this guide works here so we can better understand um, how to help you folks out, but hopefully you can get some education out of this too. Yeah. If you're like me, you're, you're kind of a visual guy. I'd love to see it all mapped out for you. Uh, super comprehensive. You have all the fins in their respective families. We do here on the board as well. Um, but this is something you can kind of look at and take home and, you know, bedtime reading, light reading for uh, figuring out your next move. But um, they're all in the families. Um, they all have are designated with your, your grip um, to release. Um, okay, so for the people that don't know what family is, what is it? So kind of goes from upright, speed, and quickness over to your carver, which is drivey and powerful type big wave Hawaiian, you know, North Shore stuff. And then you got in the middle, you know, you've got a few options in between for more, more kind of everyday, more neutral feeling fins. But um, this kind of helps you determine, you know, what fin you want to get into. Um, but brand new, just, just came out. Um, so it's great to see all our new templates on here. Um, the Tokoros, the Pizels, um, the H4s. So those are in here as well. And all our materials. So down at the bottom, we talk about neoglass, neocarbon, PC core, the PC core with carbon, and then the PG, which is the performance glass. So that goes from uh, most flex to least amount of flex. So lot. Oh, here's your sizing chart, just to give you an idea as a general rule on where you should be as far as sizing. Um, and then you've got your, your performance slide versus grip matrix down here. So, so what is the slide grip info? So you know, you're talking about your reactor is more of your more of your slide, more release. And then over here on this end, you got your carver, which is more of your grip and control. So this one is a little bit more pivoty uh, in between, a little bit of drive, and then the yeah. side, the most drive. Kind of goes this way yeah. from release and speed and pivot goes over to more control and grip as you go this way. Okay. And then you got a cup, you know, you got these performer and the accelerator um, that are kind of in the middle. Um, your performer essential, that's where you get your inside foil, which is a speed generating foil. So it's a little different in that respect there. Um, so within the families, you have a couple little nuances there. So um, the only quad sets that you have is the yeah. performer. So the only uh, essential quad sets are in the performer yeah. because that's a really good neutral, pretty, pretty upright. It's got a nice amount of release and a nice amount of drive. It's a perfect fin for a quad set. But you have the quad sets in a lot of your shaper templates. So it's a five fin set. But five fin, yeah. yeah. So you got the quad try option. So tons of those options for quads, your Merrick, your JS. Um, DHD, um, tons, Biolus, yeah. so a lot of options in your triquads. And then on the other side, this has been a lot of fun getting into the whole twin fin, longboard, alternative world. Um, lots of great info for your twin fins and your longboard fins. Um, you got your big wave set here, your Nathan Florence thruster and quad big wave set which is kind of an outlier um but then you got all your twin sets all your your fins your pro fins pro models so um lots of these are going to be releasing throughout the year a lot of this is 2023 um so pretty cool all right on yep thank you very much all righty